Um, no, it's not. It's not the only one. It's not. Scratch that. Take two. The streamline is a strim <laughs> hip, but it is a pr it side slash side sash. Hey, and welcome back to Pattern Niche on YouTube. I am Kate, one of the contributors here, and this is a channel where you're gonna find all kinds of great sewing related content to help you on your sewing journey. If that sounds like something exciting and fun and that you don't wanna miss out on, make sure you subscribe to this channel so you can be notified of upcoming videos, if you click that notification bell, that is. Today we are talking about the best patterns that Pattern Niche has to offer for beginner sewists. I know, we've all been there, scrolling through those new Facebook groups you just joined, or checking out Pinterest or Instagram, looking at all the beautiful makes that people in the sewing community are creating, and we're just so inspired, but we're also kind of overwhelmed. I mean, how the heck am I supposed to make a pair of jeans? I barely even know what a sewing machine is. And how am I supposed to know what pattern to buy, or what fabric to use, or if it even comes in my size? What the heck is a darted bodice? Ah! Social media is an incredible tool, but it can also be a sense of failure or false failure. It's something that we look at and we compare ourselves to without even getting started. And it can be the reason that we don't start. But I got something to tell you. We all start at zero. Yes, even those people sewing the beautiful couture gowns, they started at zero just like me and just like you. So today we're gonna chat about some pattern niche patterns that are great for beginners just like you. The good news, there's lots to choose from. The bad news, you have to make that decision on which to choose first. All right, so let's start with tops since that just seems to be what everyone gravitates towards when they start sewing clothes. First up is the Streamline tee. It doesn't get much more basic or easy than a Raglan t-shirt. You'll have so much fun choosing fabrics for this one, I know you're gonna end up planning more than one. The Streamline is a slim fit style with short sleeve, three quarter length, or full sleeve options. The sleeves and the bodice are hemmed, but that's the trickiest part of the whole bit. You'll have this whipped up in no time. This is a child pattern and it comes in size six month, 12 month, 18 month, 24 month, 2T, 3T, 4T, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10, 12, 14, and 16. And it is gonna cost you $9.95 American. The recommended fabrics for this pattern are stretch fabrics, knit fabrics with great stretch. I'd opt for a nice t-shirt weight cotton lycra or something like the boyfriend wash solids that the fabric snob carries. It weighs in at 180 GSM and it's just so scrumptious. It is a cotton poly spandex blend and it's great for that worn in like band tee feel. Now, if you're an adult, and you want a raglan tee, you're gonna be looking at the Riviera raglan. It has, it has loads of options, including a Henley option, the thumb hole cuffs, a hood, a slit neckline, and handkerchief hem, just to name a few. This is a pattern that you will find yourself coming back to time and time again, because there are just so many incredible options. The sizing starts at double X, small, XX small, and extends up to 3X, which in this case is up to a 51 and a half inch bust, and it's listed at 10.95. This design would be great for a variety of knit fabrics depending on what kind of look you're going for, but for a basic tee, I'd recommend the same boyfriend wash solids as I did for the children's version, the Streamline. If you're looking for a basic tee with minimal effort, you wanna check out the Dublin Dolman. It features a dropped shoulder, which is what we call a dolman, and you can either add a sleeve onto that for a long sleeve, or it just stays like that, and then it becomes one piece of the actual bodice. It is great for if you don't have a ton of fabric, but you're trying to squeeze a shirt out of it. Because there's no extra sleeve piece, it's just part of the bodice, less fabric. The bottom of the bodice and the sleeves have the option to add a band for a finish, so it's super quick, super easy, super painless if you don't wanna do hemming. But 
as your skills progress and you get more comfortable with hemming, you can definitely upgrade to that option and check out some of the other great features in this pattern as well. Again, you're gonna wanna use knit fabrics. I'd recommend something fairly stable just because it's easier to work with as a beginner. Personally, I'd probably choose a cotton lycra, 95% cotton, 5% spandex or lycra that is around 230 GSM. That's gonna be a really great starter fabric for you and I like the solids line from Sheer Perfection Fabrics. So Pattern Niche offers this pattern in XX small, extra small, and then after that it goes four, six, eight, ten, all the way up to size 26 for 10.95. But there's also a kids version, and this starts at size six to 12 months and goes up to size 16, and it's also 10.95 or you can bundle and save. So you could purchase both patterns together, not for $22, but for $17.50. A step up from the Dublin Dolman is the Bellevue Dolman, and I like to call this like the sassy step up because it is an off the shoulder top. You can choose which shoulder you want it off, it has a hemmed bottom, it's just, a step up from the Dublin. It comes with two different sleeve lengths and two different bodice lengths so you can mix and match to your heart's content. And this pattern also goes up to adult size 26. In this case that is a 51 and a half inch bust and it's listed for $9.95. Now you're going to want to choose another knit fabric at least 35% but we really want to make sure that it has great recovery. So what that means is how easily it springs back into place after it's stretched. You really don't want your fabrics being stretched out, especially since you're gonna have it off the shoulder. We don't want it sagging and bagging and falling off and you know, some fashion malfunctions happening. <laughs> to make sure it has that kind of great recovery, you're gonna wanna look for something that has a little bit of lycra spandex, lycra or spandex in it. Okay, one last dolman, cause they're so stinking easy. Next up is the Dover Dolman, and this is our first woven pattern on the list. Actually, only one of two woven patterns on the list, and I just love it because it can be dressed up or down depending on what fabrics you choose. Because it is a woven pattern, the possibilities are like virtually endless. My favorite feature are the bubble sleeve, the waist tie, and the curved hem options. I also love that it can be a shirt, a tunic, or a dress. So many options in one pattern. Oh, and did I mention it has a high-low option? If you're not familiar, that means the front hem is higher than the back hem. Yeah, pretty cool that you can make that. The Dover starts at adult sizing XX small and extends all the way up to size 30, which is a 55 and a half inch bust. This pattern does have quite a bit of positive ease built in, which means it's a looser fit garment. The cost on this one is also $9.95. As mentioned, this pattern is for woven fabrics, which means pieces with little to no stretch. It's also great for those knit fabrics that are a lot more stable and don't have a ton of stretch to them. I think this would be adorable in a plaid or a chambray for a classic shirt dress look. All right, moving on. A cute, swingy, summer style tank top for free. This is gonna be perfect for the hot summers that we are all looking forward to, I'm sure. I think this is a great beginner pattern because it offers a high impact with really minimal effort and simple design details. You'll be able to finish the neckline and the armholes with either bands or binding depending on your comfort level and your style preference. The pattern offers two lengths, cropped or full length with a hemmed bottom. But I would say this would look super adorable if it was just left raw and not hemmed, so you can totally play around with that if that's something you're into too. A cute little pocket option allows you to play with fabric choices and add some personality to your make. I'll, overall, I think this is a great gateway pattern for you to practice your new skill. The listing recommends knit fabrics with at least 35% stretch. I would personally opt for something lightweight for that really nice flowy effect. If you're feeling adventurous, try out a bamboo jersey. It's not much harder to work with than cotton lycra, but it has a really nice drape to it. Now don't be fooled by the weight. It is heavier than cotton lycra on average, but it really does have that beautiful flowy drapey look that we really want in a nice swingy top. The child size comes in 12 to 18 months all the way up to size 16 and the adult starts at double XS and extends up to 3X. And did I mention the best part? It's free! Now, if standing out is your game, 
you have to try the Olympia. Its beautiful open side design is perfect for showcasing your new talent. It has loads of options, which means you're gonna get so much practice in your sewing and it's just gonna add that extra punch to your makes. You can choose between two different hood and neckline styles or just no hood at all. You can also choose between the lengths of it. And there's an adorable kangaroo pocket that you can patch on the front or if you're not into that, leave it off. The recommended fabrics for this one is also knit fabrics, but this time with about 25% stretch. So you don't need as much stretch. If I were to make one, I would choose a fabric with a little bit more heft to it. So depending on what you're wanting to use it for, maybe find a nice cotton or bamboo French terry, or if you want something a little more luxurious, go for a tencel or a bamboo fleece. This pattern is also available in kids and adult sizes. Each pattern is $9.95 or you can bundle up and save and just pay $16.50 for both sets of sizes. All right, the final beginner friendly top pattern is the Kawaii Cover Up. This is a great starter pattern for those finer, more delicate fabrics that you might be kind of scared to try otherwise. Style it over a bathing suit, your everyday outfit, or even pajamas just for that added extra touch of luxe. This design has options for hem, length, drawstring at the waist, and even side splits. The easy dolman style of it makes it a quick sew while still being able to practice some great sewing techniques. The kawaii was made with really lightweight wovens in mind, but could definitely be used in a mid-weight or slightly heavier weight woven fabrics as well for more of an outerwear piece or even a house jacket. I see an ethereal version floating down the sunset kissed beach. So I would probably choose a chalet or a georgette or a crepe maybe even a gauze. The sizing on this is marked as a double zero up to size 30, which equates to a 55 and a half inch bust, but the fitting on it is quite roomy, especially if you don't plan to like cover it all the way up. Oh, and I haven't even mentioned the best part. It's free. Okay, let's move on to dresses and skirts. There's an adorable little dress for kids that I think is great for beginners, and it is the Tahiti dress. A split side seam tank dress that can be dressed up or down depending on which options you choose. So it can be as simple or as elevated as you choose. Decide between standard or racer back, curved or straight hem, front pockets, side sash, knee or maxi length. So many options. Neck and arm openings are finished with bands for a quick and easy sew. In fact, this entire make is quick and easy. I bet you can have one made up in under an hour. This is yet another knit pattern. This time, you'll wanna find a fabric with at least 50% stretch, since it is a body skimming style. I'd probably go for a light to medium weight option, maybe in a rayon to get that really beautiful draping and kind of luxurious feel. The Tahiti comes in child sizes 12 to 18 months up to 16 and it is 9.95. All right, let's move on to the pier side pencil skirt. This is an adult pattern and it is the boss of comfortable skirts. The pier side is a flattering, relaxed design featuring a tall yoga style waistband, pockets, three length options and the opportunity to use a curved hem. The pattern is a true mama and me favorite since it comes in child sizes 12 months all the way up to size 16 and adult sizes extra extra small to size 26 which equates to a 53 and a half inch hip and it can be purchased as a bundle for $16.50 or separately for $9.95 each. Fabric suggestions include knits with at least 35% stretch. I think this would be really fun in stretch suede or faux leather. Just be sure to check the stretch percentages of the fabric when you're buying it. So you might need to alter the pattern accordingly or adjust accordingly, maybe go up a size, something like that. Okay, let's move on to pants. So there's the Karita joggers. I mean, who doesn't love a great pair of joggers? Pants might look intimidating, but they're actually a really great place to start for beginners because there's very little finishing details and sweatpants especially are super forgiving with fit. This style offers a higher yoga style waistband, fun rounded slash pockets, and capri or full length options. Cuffed leg bottoms mean a quick and easy finish.
finish. Once again, you're gonna wanna opt for a nice stretch knit fabric, something with at least 35% stretch. You could really have a lot of fun here depending on the look that you're going for. I would choose a nice heavy sweat knit, maybe a tensile or bamboo fleece for a lounge pair, smooth and light or airy cotton or bamboo lycra for if you're planning to sleep in them, or even some sexy drapey rayon for an elevated out on the town look. Sizing for this one is available in kids sizes 12 to 18 month all the way up to size 16 as well as adult sizes extra extra small all the way up to size 26 which is a 53 and a half inch hip. Each size range is available for $9.95 or you can bundle up and save a couple bucks. If you're looking for something a little more office appropriate check out the Portlander pants. This style also features the taller waistband yoga style waistband that can be folded over and pockets but it's a wide leg design allowing for a bit more polished look while still being uber comfortable this pattern also allows you to make shorts out of the same pattern so you can use it all year round fabric requirements are the same as the Karitas if it's a polished pair you're after I'd recommend a solid color in something a little more stable like a Ponty or a Liverpool just be sure to check the stretch percentage and adjust your pattern accordingly if necessary. And again, this one comes in kids sizes 12 to 18 months up to 16 and adult sizes extra extra small up to size 26. Again, the 53 and a half inch hip. Separate patterns for $9.95 or bundle up for $16.50. The last pattern on our list is the Lanai Loungers. I find this design so versatile. A woven casual pant, perfect to use as pajamas or some fabulous good wear bottoms. This pattern offers a tapered and straight leg option as well as a shorts cut line. Of course it has side pockets, but also some cute back patch pockets if you feel like taking that next step in your sewing journey. Again, the options are essentially endless on fabric choices here. I'd probably choose a nice light or medium weight linen for day wear. Sucker for linen or cozy cotton flannel for pajamas. You would also be able to use a stable knit for this design as well. And the lanai's are available in sizes double zero up to size 30, and that is a 57 and a half inch hip. And the cost on this one is $9.95, but you can actually bundle it up with the Maui tank for $16.50, which is kind of a unique option on the Pattern Niche website. Whew, so there it is. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got your, had your note pad ready and you made some you made some notes we will have all of these patterns linked down in the description box for you to easily access but i hope you you know choose which ones you like if not just go back and watch it again if this was helpful make sure you give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button and i will catch you next time bye